uh, first solo race of um, 2022, uh, the solo matricoc and uh, out of Les Sables along. Uh, lovely Les Sables behind us. And uh, it's not a not a bad start. We're out. Um, it's uh, about uh, 11 o'clock now. It's a lot earlier now. It's about half past ten. Yeah, half past ten here. Um, French time and uh, start is in an hour from now, half past 11. Um, we are plumbaged, uh, everything's set, boat's in pretty good condition. Uh, Paddy's done an awesome job over last week and um, yeah, it looks like it's going to be a kind of relatively classic solo match of cock. So downwind through uh, inside of Ile de Ray, around Ile de Ray to the bridge then upwind after that uh, with hopefully the wind going more into the northeast tonight and then it's pretty much a fetch all the way through the night all the way up to um Belle Isle. so uh be nice if that's the way it turns out um and uh yeah uh looking forward to getting back in on thursday hopefully sometime around thursday lunchtime and uh yeah, let's see how today goes and uh see how this race goes Join me here at uh, day two. Uh, I know what time it is, probably about midday. Um, we, uh, yeah, we, we have, last time I was talking to you, it was a start, so, um, yeah, it was good. Downwind towards the other way, a bit of a transition. Didn't do so well, didn't do so badly out of it either. Um, and then we ran underneath the bridge. Uh, did quite well on a Janak, quite a Janak feel actually. Quite nice. Um, and then, uh, yeah, we were just short tacking up the uh, west side of Ile de Ray. Um, got pretty breezy, and then we've just been beaten all night, so uh, pretty, pretty drained. Um, and here we are, you probably see them covered in sunscreen, just had a chance to put some on. And uh, we are on the way back south which is nice. So we've gone around Belle Isle. Sun's out. Big rolling waves that were horrible to drive in last night are now, uh, now quite pleasant. Surfing down them is quite nice. Um, kites up, sun's out. And uh, yeah, all good. Uh, day three. Video report. Uh, so much cock 2022. Um, so we had a pretty, pretty hairy day yesterday. Issues with the port rudder, uh, a little tear in the jib. Um, we all fun and games, autopilot. Uh, but we kind of held it all together and um, going into Les Sables last night, rounding uh, the little dummy line that you have to go through just in case they decide to shorten the course. I'm um, not exactly sure position, but I think we were in the top 10, which was nice. Um, then uh, they sent us out on the dog leg, uh, 35 miles out, 35 miles back to the uh, Hydro Boy. I uh, didn't think it was a great decision, if I'm honest, but anyway, I'm not in charge. Uh, we screamed out to it, and then we've been, um, we got around at about like 2 in the morning. 10 hours later, it's half 12, and we've been drifting around in no wind all day and um, breeze has finally come in and we're, we're on the last stretch now into the finish. Uh, got um, the cup um, and uh, we're sailing as high as we possibly can with that. Couple of guys still around, uh, lost some places this morning definitely. Uh, no idea where I am to be honest. And, uh, yeah, uh, that's it. Morning, it's um, mm, what time is it? It's uh, yeah, nine o'clock, uh, French time, uh, Saturday. So, um, we finished the, the offshore race, had a day off yesterday, which was which was awesome. A lot of sleeping, a lot of eating. Um, and we're out here today for um, coastal race. A short race they've given us uh, 
a banan which is uh, essentially two laps of a windward lured. Um, the weather is, is very unstable. Um, it's uh, just, we just don't know what's going to happen at the moment. We've got a, a westerly, or sorry, an easterly breeze uh, coming off the land. Um, it's due to come right as the day goes on and eventually fill in from the the west into the northwest for tomorrow we actually have tomorrow we got a good bit more breeze from the west northwest for our other coastal race um yeah so two laps when we're lured um really is anybody's guess what's actually going to happen and um all right we're set uh recharged the boat recharged the kenny and um yeah feeling good uh no massive repairs to do after the, the big offshore and uh yeah, we'll see how today goes. We'll uh, try and update you if we can, but it's an inshore race, so it'll be pretty intense. Uh, probably won't get a chance to have the camera out.